Hello guys, welcome back to the Hubin Talent channel. My name is Kitty, for those who don't know. And today is going to be another cooking video with me. And I'm going to show you how to make the glazed Chinese barbecue beef stir fry with pak choy and steamed rice. Okay, let's get to it. So here are the ingredients that you'll need for two serve. I will also list this down in the description box. So you need about 250 gram of beef stir fry, 5 gram of toasted sesame seed, 5 gram of Chinese barbecue seasoning, 2 tablespoons of cake cab menace, 1 bunch of pak choy, 150 gram of jasmine rice, 2 teaspoon of vegetable oil, 2 teaspoon of white vinegar, 2 teaspoon of honey, and 1 tablespoon of soy sauce. And as per usual, don't forget to wash your hands for 20 seconds before you start cooking. And guys, don't forget to wash your vegetable before you start cooking. So the first step is to cook rice. Um, you can use the rice cooker or pressure cooker but if you have none of those what you can do is first rinse the rice until water runs clear put in a small saucepan with one cup of water cover and bring to a simmer over medium heat then you reduce the heat to low and cook for 12 minutes or just until tender and water is absorbed then you turn off the heat and stand covered for at least five minutes step two is to make the glaze um, so first you will need to chop up your pak choy then put in the care cap manis one tablespoon soy sauce two teaspoon white vinegar and two teaspoon honey in a bowl season with pepper and stir to combine step three stir fry your beef so separate the beef stir fry into a bowl then you add in the Chinese barbecue seasoning and 2 teaspoon vegetable oil season with salt and pepper and toss to coat heat um, a large fry pan over high heat until very hot then you put in your beef and stir fry for about 2 minutes or until brown remove from the pan Step 4 is to stir fry your pak choy. You turn the pan to the medium high heat. You add in your pak choy and 1 tablespoon of water. And stir fry for about 2 minutes or until tender but still with a crunch. Remove from the pan. Then you need to add in the glazed mixture to the pan and cook for 30 seconds or until sticky. Remove the pan from the heat and add in the beef and toss to coat um, but don't forget to not add in the beef water like I did or your beef won't be sticky but it will look um, wet final step serve up so just divide your rice pak choy and beef among the bowls drizzle over the pan juices scatter sesame seed and you're done and here is the final result for this dish and here it is i hope you guys enjoyed this video so far don't forget to let me know how you go in the comment section down below and don't forget to give this video a thumb up subscribe to our channel and ring that bell for more video bells and until next time love you all bye <laughs>